On our search for Italian food here in Japan, we came across this adorable wooden Anpan Man. Now, if you know what Anpan Man is, he's a Japanese superhero for little kids. He's really popular here. So we found this really cool Italian restaurant. It's called Tabako Ya Kinye, which really literally means tobacco store, but no smoking. And uh, we thought it was really cool and it had some good reviews. So we decided to take a look. Not only that, this used to be an izakaya or Japanese style pub uh, where the master, the chef, used to make these pasta dishes that the, uh, that the locals really enjoyed. So he decided to actually create an, an entire Italian restaurant around it. And he bought up this uh, old tobacco store and refurbished it into an Italian restaurant. Inside the actual Italian restaurant, Tabako Ya Kinyen, uh, it has a lot of uh, wooden stools and chairs. It's quite quaint, quite small. They have a wine selection and it's pretty pleasant, I thought. They have a chalkboard where they list their specials for the day. Really cool stuff. The meal started off with a Japanese inspired salad with corn, nori, or Japanese seaweed, or seaweed I should say, romaine lettuce, and a shoyu or soy sauce based wafu dressing. Wafu just stands for anything Japanese cuisine related. And there was also a nice little chopstick holder with a little clay face. I thought it was really cool, a lot of detail in that. Really cool stuff. So can you tell me what was on this pasta that we had, the first one we ordered? Well, this is a cream-based pasta with a bacon and a mushroom. And on the top, there was a broccoli and their owner said it is freshly harvested in the morning. It was just really taste, tasty. It was very delicious. Thank you for letting me know about that. Um, how did you find this restaurant, by the way? Oh, well, I was looking for the restaurant around there and then I found there one review and it, he said real, the, the restaurant is really, really good and also it's kind of hidden area. So I was so interested and they're actually the atmosphere was really good. So the second pasta we shared was also amazing. Uh, can you tell us what was in that one? Well, this is this one said the basil oil pasta with a shrimp and the onion. And uh, not only the shrimp and the onion, there's also cabbage and mushroom. And on the top, there's a red paprika. Yeah, it was really good. Um, which out of the two did you enjoy the most? The the cream based one or the or this mushroom one? Well, it's really hard to say because they are very different. But, well, me personally, I, I really like a cream pasta, so I say cream pasta. I, I like the I like this mushroom one more, but yeah, it was very delicious. So what did you think about our experience eating Italian food here in Japan? Italian food in Japan? Yeah. Well, well this restaurant in this particular. This restaurant? Okay, Tabako so, Kinyan. Tabako, tabako Ya Kinyan. They actually said the wafu pasta. They, they made their spaghetti, like Italian spaghetti, like a Japanese. And it was really interesting because there's, a, there's actually one more the main course, which is a Japanese dashi based spaghetti. We didn't order, but actually I'm very interested in it. We should go there again. We should go there again and order yeah. that. I was really impressed by that restaurant. Thank you for finding it. Mm -hmm. Let's go there again. Okay.